years off. Now we're doing this because we're having some special filming. As long as there's no flashing going off. Oh good, you're getting something, huh? See, this isn't bothering her because her head is still facing the darkness. Can you hear her kind of grunting? Yeah, Sighing. I heard it. It's loud right now with the, the waves. Yeah. Now these little eggs right now are not little boys and not little girls. They're just little it. It takes about 60 days for a loggerhead egg to incubate in the nest. In the middle of the second trimester, which would be probably in the 20 and 40 day range, somewhere in the middle there, is when nature decides whether the egg's going to be boys or girls. And what happens, the warmer the sun and the, the warmer the incubation, it's going to be the little girl. The cooler the incubation will be the little boy. So the eggs that she drops last that are closest to the top of the nest. Oh, sorry. That was a flash. Yeah. Turned it off. Let's okay. not do that. Yeah. Uh, the the uh, the eggs that are closest to the top, getting all the sun and everything, are going to be little girls. The eggs that are sort of in the middle of the clutch of 100 are going to be little girls. The little boys are going to be incubating out in the cooler sand, and the ones in the bottom are going to be little boys. So that's how nature gives us little boys and little girls. Right now, they're just all little it. Now, a turtle, as it grows in the eggs, these eggs are very flexible because they're dropping one on top of the other. There's yeah. a lot of lubricant. Oh. It's not like a chicken egg or anything. If you dropped a chicken egg on another egg or on it a bunch crack. of eggs, they would crack. Right. These are very flexible. They, they might dent, but they, you know, are, they're just dropping down on each other with the lubricant.